fresh. <laughs> because we fell in love. Yeah, I'm an artist and I'm also Chirabo Tracy as a student at IUEA. I'm so glad to be here. I am doing, um, I'm pursuing a degree in business administration and I'm doing second year. Yes. Um, but um, yeah, yeah. So I chose IUEA because um, I think it's because um, the first time I was going to IUEA, they had this bursary. It was 50% off every student. And, you know, I, I struggled to pay tuition because I do it by myself. So I needed a school that does something that IUEA does. And that means teaching English and every, like the lecturers are available. And, you know, my friends were telling me about the school and all these advantages and, you know, the benefits and the, man, the pricing the school. So I was like, oh my God, I would love to step into a school that good, but then I don't have the money. Uh, so <laughs> I'm just at home seated. And then the ad of, oh, IUEA, we are giving. I was actually in an Uber, I think, going home, and that ad was running on Sanyu Uber, something like that. I immediately told the Uber guy, mm, let's go, Ari. <laughs> let's go, Ari, just uh, and start, you know, being a cool girl in town, studying at IUEA. Yeah, b besides that, and oh, I think I also chose to stay in the school because I would maybe be there a year or two and leave, but I decided to stay in the school because I think it's the best university in Uganda, honestly. It is. It's clean, it's beautiful, it's, it's everything. I love it. I've been at IUEA, I think, three years now, but I haven't yet graduated. It's because I think in the middle of the year when I became Miss IUEA and I expected another bursary and oh my god it was just a little bit of a maze for me and then at the time I also got signed yeah as an artist my career began and I didn't study a whole year <laughs> I did not study a whole year and oh god it hurt me so bad it really hurt because I think I had to graduate last year but then I had to graduate this year and COVID happened and hmm, I'm sad, I'm not happy. <laughs> I'm not happy about this. At school, I try as hard as I can to be different from peer pounds. I make sure that peer pounds is nowhere in my class. And that means from dress code to, you know, I don't wear any makeup going to school. I don't dress that good going to school. I put on my sweatpants and I will go to school. I don't care, I'll be in my crocs, I'll go to school. I'm, I'm very cool at the compound because I think everybody literally knows me at school. So, you know, you, you're passing around, hi, Pia, hi, Tracy, hi, 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 hi. So I try to smile and be in a good mood from when I enter the gate of my school, it's like home, can you imagine? You enter your home, everybody knows you, and it's, I feel like I'm a sweetheart at school. I swear to God, I don't try to show, I don't even, some people don't even know I'm an artist, they just know I'm a popular kid at school, can you imagine? I love school, <laughs> I love my school. So we had, um, I think we had just started school, we had just started the second semester of my sec my last year oh, my second year i think yeah and covid happened i remember the first week at school when it happened how we were sanitizing at every entrance literally and i was just with my friends that guys are we going to even manage this and then the next week the president addressed the nation and said we would have to stay home eat hard from the beginning because you know some of us are trying to get done with school so we can get done with school so, <laughs> so having to sit home for months it's now six months it's just crazy i think it's really crazy i don't like it at all i'm not happy about it like i don't want covid to stop me it has stopped me from education again it should it shouldn't stop me from pursuing my dreams yeah
about the activities that I am doing during COVID, the very first is eat. I eat and I eat. I've gained weight. People are saying I've gained weight. And then secondly, I record. I keep in studio because my studio is close to my house. So it's just walkable distance. So I'm always creating new stuff because as a musician, I want to be I want to be great, and as a student, I want to be even greater. So, yeah, I try to access my notes from school because you know my school is that kind of school that is very familiar with the internet. <laughs> so yes, we have notes going on, and of course, readable classes, yeah, going on on e-learning. So we we are good. We are good. I think when we start the semester again, it's going to be us basically doing papers or coursework and research. So we, we won't be like you guys who are going to repeat the whole semester. It's just so funny. You miss about school. Oh, I miss, I think, no, I think from school, I, I, I miss school most because you know at university and especially mine and with my kind of career that I chose. I'm not really so much at school lousing around. I come to study and leave. So I, I miss that part that I walk in, study and leave and nobody minds my business, you know. Yeah, my school is authentic. It's, um, it's online. It's, it knows the next thing coming and you know, yeah, it's online. My school is very clean. I've not seen a, a school that clean in Uganda here. I really haven't. The word international makes a lot of sense in the name International University of East Africa, because really we try to keep it that way. And even as the students, we, we feel it, you know? So there is a lot of vibe, a lot of fashion gray. I hear kids can dress. <laughs> they can dress. I'm sometimes like, wow, I, I, why don't I even ever mind about clothes at school. Chicks come dressed to kill and I'm like. Anyway, also my lecturers. I've never been in a lecture and a lecturer misses a lecture at my school. And remember, I've been there for three years. So imagine, never have I ever been in a lecture and a lecturer misses to come in that lecture. Um, an advice I'll give I won't say just celebrities, but every other human being that requires to have um, a beautiful life, to be successful in life. Every girl deserves a choice and a chance. Education is the most important achievement that any woman can ever achieve. It's that's the most important. And you know, it doesn't matter how old you are. It doesn't matter how busy you are. It doesn't matter how less fortunate you are. Let me tell you something. When it comes to education, you have to fight like this is your fight. It's, you're not fighting for anybody else. It's you and your children and your legacy. So stay in school and choose IEA because honestly, it understands you. It gets you. And like, that's the place for you. <laughs> that is it. That's the place for you.